Hello everyone and welcome to uh, another video. This one is all about our trip to Oxford that we took a few weeks ago. I realized as I was editing it that I didn't say anything to the camera at all. I just took video of what we were doing. So I thought I'd sit down and tell you a little bit about the fun things that we got up to. started our day off with a visit to Christchurch College, which is a very beautiful college campus, one of the many that Oxford has. I say many because I don't remember, 27? I think Oxford has 27 colleges. Yeah, so we started our day at Christchurch with a little kind of tour of the place. is the college um, where the first scene in Harry Potter of Harry Potter and all of his classmates walking up the stairs with McGonagall to go into the Great Hall for the first time. That staircase and the inspiration for that Great Hall is actually at Christ Church College. Um, so we got to go and see that. Um, if you don't know what I'm talking about, I'm gonna try and put the little clip here. Welcome to Hogwarts. So in the Great Hall, you can kind of see how the setup was very much an inspiration for the Harry Potter Great Hall. There's also lots of things that you see around the hall um, that kind of go back to Alice in Wonderland. Um, and this is because the person who wrote Alice in Wonderland somehow has connections that our tour guide told us about, but I don't remember. Sorry. Um, but there's the one stained glass window that is really nice that I tried to film, but you can't really tell. But there's like Alice's head is there and there's a couple other characters from Wonderland in the window. And then the decorations on the fireplace beside it are kind of the inspiration for the moment when Alice drinks the potion, her neck extends and goes really, really long. Um, and also the inspiration for Tweedledee and Tweedledum. Christchurch College is also a very unique college because it is the only one that has a cathedral as its campus chapel. We got to have a little tour of the cathedral as well, and it's actually where John Wesley preached. We also went to Regents Park College, which, Regents Park? I think that's what it's called. We also went to Regents Park College, um, which was the first non-Anglican college. And the Eagle and Child um, actually shares one of the walls with um, Regents Park. The Eagle and Child is the pub 
where um, Lewis and Tolkien kind of hung out and wrote some of their stories. Um, and we unfortunately couldn't go in because COVID got it, but we did get to stand outside of it and talk about it. So I have footage of that. On our way back from Reedens College to lunch, we um, had a little bit of a tour of the places in Oxford. And one of those places was just like a black cross on the pavement, which I think I have a video clip of, so I'll put it here. And that's actually the spot where Thomas Cranmer and two other people that I don't remember the names of were martyred there because, you know, the English royalty didn't like them, so they killed them. I forgot to mention, as a part of our tour of Oxford, we also got to see some of the libraries and some of the different places. We did get to see the old, like, theological, theological studies part of the library, I think is what it was called, um, which is actually what they used as the hospital wing in the Harry Potter movies, which is very interesting. And then at the end of the day, we just got to walk around and tour the city of Oxford, um, go into different shops if we wanted, um, and just kind of see all the sights that were around, enjoy the Christmas lights. And um, that was kind of the end of our day. enjoyed watching this. I had fun going and filming um, and I will see you next time. Bye!